afternoon, guys. Uh, this is uh, Kurt from Plur of NowPlanet.tv. And we're here now at the Rico uh, uh, booth. And I'm here now with Ms. Irene D. Santos, uh, General Manager of the Sales and Marketing Division, and Mr. Dave B. Abal, of, uh, the Business Unit Head of the Channel Group of uh, Sales and Marketing Division. And we're here actually now at the Graphic Expo at the SMX Convention Center. So, um, um, uh, welcome, very, uh, welcome, and thank you for uh, for being a guest here on NowPlanet.tv. And uh, maybe you could share some bits and pieces of what Rico is all about and uh, the brief history of Rico, maybe in the Philippines. Okay, well, first I would like to thank you, Christian, and your team for giving it that, this opportunity for us to share what Rico can offer in the industry. Rico has been here for 15 years, and um, we are known for multi-function devices and copiers at that time. Now we're moving into the digital technology where we included already all the production printing devices and also the new business at Rico, which is being handled by Dave, which is the audio visual business where we have some projectors and unified communication systems, which Dave will be uh, uh, sharing with you later. Okay. Now, uh, Rico, I understand that the company is the, um, uh, w what is the, where is the headquarters of Rico? Yeah, of course, this is a 100% multinational and Japanese company, but our Asia Pacific is this is where we report the regional office. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Now, given the, um, you know, we're here at the Print Expo, the Graphic Expo, and Rico has been supporting the Graphic Expo for several years already. Yeah. What can we see new with Rico this year? I mean, you've been, how many years have you been uh, participating in the, in the graphic act? Well, maybe five years or more, yes. But maybe at the time I wasn't with Rico yet, but uh, when I get in, I know that they've been particip participating for several years already. So what's something new with Rico now, as I mentioned, is we are now into production printing business. That's the new business of our man, Sonny, the audio visual. That's why we are so keen now with the Rico production printing uh, color business, which these are the outputs uh, we would like to present to you later. So this, this, this one, and this one's for banner as well, and a lot of other applications also that our machine for us to listen can do. So how about today with your product? Yeah, actually uh, it's very interesting because Rico, um, we'll be launching the first ever portable digital conferencing system here in the Philippines. It's actually cloud-based, okay, accompanied with a lot of um, projector lineup. Actually, we will also be launching the PJWX4130. This is the closest range ultra short of projector in the world, and we are very much excited to launch here in the Philippines. So later I can show it to you. Yeah, yeah, that would be very nice. And given this new product, I assume, um, and given the new technology that Rico is, um, you know, uh, you know, uh, introducing to the market, uh, how do you see Rico in the next couple of years? Given that the photographic industry is booming here in the Philippines, so how do you see entering into the market? Given you know there are lots of competitors out there. Yeah, yeah. Well, um, we take one step at a time to stand, you know. And we would like to share with you that uh, we're taking the steps with the voice of customer as well, uh, taking into consideration. That's why our research and development is really working hard for us to be able to address market requirements and also be in maybe a leader one day to show technology that no one else can do. Uh, Rico has a lot of applications. Actually, later, maybe we can share it with him. We can show it to you, even applications for iPad and iPhones as well, for smartphone devices as well. Um, where we're looking at, uh, maybe Rico will not be, will no longer be known only in the copying or multi-function devices, but overall um, technology provider in the IT industry. So that is really our, maybe, uh, goal for the moment uh, to be known in the IT industry, not only in um, multifunction and digital printing, etc. Okay, can you Maybe on my final note, before we uh, introduce uh, more of your product, right now, of course, you know, the Pinoy is very social media, digital media. 
how do you think the uh, Rico can play a big role given you know there are lots of social media out there Facebook Twitter uh, given on your product uh, I know because one can easily share a photo or, or a print uh, what is there anything that Rico can actually provide or give value to the digital media industry out there well uh, with regards to printing as, as you can see any any single print can go a long way so it can be a solution to any of the goals of each um, industry it can it can be uh, a system uh, I'm sorry uh, uh, it can be a profit generating as well so it can go a long way one print can go a long way it can do it can change lives of people in terms of the graphic art industry where you know um, you can apply customization as well, personalization as well. So there are a lot to offer actually, and there's a million actually of solutions and applications based on each and everyone's requirements. So, so we would like to see we go going towards that direction. Perfect. Yes. With the AV, also the yes, yes. same as very digital media and stuff, and uh, that caught my attention, especially since I, I am into the digital media. So maybe later we can, uh, anything that you wanted to add? Okay. Yeah, maybe later we can um, more um, future products. And uh, yeah, so that's about it for now. Here at the Graphic Expo, and uh, I'm from NowPlanet.tv. And again, joining us is Ms. Santos of, uh, of Rico. And uh, maybe Ms. Santos can give us an overview of it. I mean, this is a, this is a wow, this is a beast printer. Maybe you can know, share to us uh, what is this printer all about. Yes, of course. Uh, thank you again for giving us this opportunity to show to you what Rico can offer in terms of production business. So this is the latest that we have. We call it the Pro C 751 series. This is also a multi-function, but by end, this is, uh, we call it the press printer. So this is, uh, it comes with an external controller, the EFI, which is our partner as well. So this is where we do color management. So my graphic artists and details also helping us doing this, all the color management. And then we do have this engine with uh, the speed of 75 pages per minute. This one can handle up to 13 by 19.2 and also can handle 13 by 24 in terms of banner printing. If I can uh, share with you some banner printouts, uh, these are the printouts of this machine. And this, if you see, if you notice, we already opened it. These are the toners and the drums that we use. A very, very user-friendly machine. And this one, high productivity with high image quality as well. It uses a different technology of uh, uh, toner. Uh, can you explain uh, the toner in terms of technology? What are we using? Our experts here will share with us. Uh, this uh, newly new machine is uh, using the elect uh, electrostatic technology, using the latest toner with the uh, smallest uh, grain, so that uh, the image quality output uh, have a sharper detail. Oh, interesting, interesting. It handles several media in the media library. As what you mentioned, maybe it's a book overview with that. It yes. be all. So this is like the the main console. This, this is, is the, the, the cockpit, the, the, the brain of, of, the, of, the, the, of the printer. Yeah. So maybe just a quick, uh, so this is like a uh, the brain and then you just put in a USB. It can be a USB. USB. It can be a file from a command workstation because it just has to do some adjustments mm -hmm. and then uh, you, everything will happen here and then color management, some calibrations as well, even some viable data printing as well and then after that it goes to the engine itself okay. and the output later. Alright, alright. Yeah. Maybe the camera can now focus on the unit, on the unit itself? Yes. This one also can do folding and uh, envelope printing, so one-to-one -one marketing as well. Okay. And then um, we can also do some booklets. Uh, okay. Out, go tour, sure. manuals, and a lot of collaterals as well. And also photo book. Now, oh, perfect. Yeah, yeah. 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 photography, yeah. wedding. Yes, wedding. So everything is customized, personalized. Mm -hmm. So you, you can have it printed in our tea 
Now, this is already out in the market. Is it? And yeah. where can they contact you? Uh, would you want to invite your 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 customers? Yes, to talk to you to purchase the any information. Yes, Lisa, thank you for that. Well, I would like to take this opportunity to invite everyone to who wants to put up their own business or for corporations with their own mail rooms to do the, to that as graphic artists as well. So we are located in 349 um, Open Building, Senator Hill Puyat Avenue, Makati City, and you can call us at 750-7383. Okay. And you can also check out our website, which is www. Uh, you can visit us at uh, www.trico.com.ph uh, uh, My Facebook then. And Facebook, yes. Okay. So, so I Facebook. I want them to be here as well. John, can you share the Facebook site as Rico? Yes, you can visit our Facebook site at www.ricofails.com. Okay. Thank you, John. Perfect, perfect. Okay. So, okay, so that's it. Uh, later, we will be uh, doing a product demo of the Rico Pro C seven five one ES. Uh, hi, I'm Elmer Valiare of Rico Philippines, uh, a product pre-sales specialist for the production printing business group of Rico. Uh, here at our Wi-Fi controller, this is the main uh, tactic or the controller where to, we can uh, rasterize our file, our PDF file, and it's very easy. You can you just need a PDF file, it's already in the USB, and uh, just plug in the USB. USB port and then it, it will ready to print. Uh, uh, this is the printing properties and uh, when I in, uh, imported the job and then uh, doing some small uh, additional uh, print, uh, to the printer, additional effect to the printer and uh, it will go. So when once once I press the print, it will print out the digital uh, the, the image uh, beautifully. So once you see the blue light, that means uh, the, the, it's in operation already and uh, we are ready to have the good output quality of our Rico Pro C751 here. So what we have now is uh, the printed uh, sample of the menu that uh, we have. Uh, we just uh, printed on the 12 by 18 glossy size paper and uh, in a little short period of time we can see a good output quality of our Rico Pro C751 yes. That's it and thank you very much. Okay, uh, good afternoon. Allow me to introduce to you the PJWX4130. This is the lightest and the closest range to ultra short row projector in the world. As you can see here, you can project at a distance of 4.6 inches for you to be able to project an 80 inch, um, 80 inch image. Okay, so this is DLT, top of the line, and actually um, you can also incorporate your iPad using this, this type of projector. And um, this one, sir, I would like to introduce the 3340N. This is actually for the first projector in the world that incorporates a DSLR lens when projecting. Um, just to let you know, actually, uh, Pentax is the Rico company. So we are actually incorporating Pentax lenses in our projection uh, system. So that's why you can see the details of the, details of the image. Okay, and um, this type of projector also supports wireless. Um, you can just uh, load your videos or any presentation in your USB sound drive, and you can present right away. Okay, and it's Wi-Fi capable also. Um, currently, it supports um, Apple devices, iPads, 
but but coming September we will be launching the Android version of these two models. Actually, we are very much excited um, to launch it here in the Philippines because I mean it's non-traditional type of product. It's the very first in the market. It, it will be the very first as well in the Philippines. Thank you.